New at six, too much stress on the lower back of young athletes can cause a debilitating condition involving a stress fracture when one vertebra slips onto another. Now less invasive back surgery and more precise tools are making surgery safer and improving outcomes. 12-year-old Kaylee Clemens practiced gymnastics beginning at age five. I could do backhand springs all over the yard. I could, I practiced all the time. Hello, Kaylee. She developed severe back pain and was finally diagnosed with spondylolisthesis, a spinal deformity made worse by extreme physical stress. She was looking at a, a very difficult life ahead of her with back pain and leg pain if this is left untreated. He looked me square in the face and he told me she's going to dance again. Right, left. Now just four months after surgery, Kaylee is dancing, regaining her balance and lifting weights. And she's two and a half inches taller. This is the ultrasonic bone scalpel. As one of my former fellows said, this is the game changer. The ultrasonic bone scalpel vibrates 22,500 times per second to precisely cut bone, but the tip is not sharp and bounces off soft tissue, so it's a safer, less intrusive way of doing spinal surgery. That's her bone that I use the ultrasonic device to fashion, so it's a perfect fit, and then the screws again and the rods. I can't believe where I am now. In January when we were facing, you know, a wheelchair, diapers, you know, just all those things that go through our head to now she's riding her bike. Dr. Lieberman says when Kaylee's back heals completely, she would be able to continue gymnastics if she wanted.